आज हामीले उहाँसँग को एक अन्तर्दृष्टिपूर्ण दूर संवाद प्रस्तुत गर्न पाएकोमा धन्य महसुस गरेका छौँ जसको शीर्षक छ सज्जन बन्नुहोस् सज्जन जस्तै सोच्नुहोस् केवल ईश्वरको चाहना राख्नुहोस् भाग बाह्र मध्येको तेस्रो भाग गुरु र शिष्यहरू बिचमा सेप्टेम्बर पन्ध्र दुई हजार चौधमा अङ्ग्रेजीमा अमेरिकाको लस एन्जलसमा दिएको प्रवचन Yeah, now I write in MG and Gazil- Gaga. Yes. <laughs> like, yes, <master>. you're going Gaga. <laughs> so funny, if you read my diaries, it look funny. Yeah. It's more convenient than Waymaster. Yeah, I have to meditate sometime next, next to a garbage can or any, anywhere as long as there's a connection. Okay, people would sit in yes, a special holy corner or in a church or in a temple. I sit next to a garbage can. <laughs> wow. Uh, Sometimes, not, not every time. Huh? It depends on when. And... I understand, Master. Okay, any more? Yes, Master. Thank you so much for all the blessing you, you have given for our planet, Master, in this time. Thank you very much. We appreciate it so much. You're welcome. That's a continuing work. I don't always tell you, huh? Okay. Mm-hmm. Yes, Master. Yes, by the Master, way. Yes. W- would we be able to know if more Tukwa are matured, would this help our world to become more positive? Um, yes, surely. Without it, our world would have been gone. Oh, yes, Master. I understand. From so much calm and so much desire, this disaster and so much, uh, uh, you know, uh, climate uh, problem. Yes, Master. I, I know it looked bad now, but it could have been worse if, if the EOSCO didn't work, it didn't help, and if, if the not so many Tukwa has been mature, you know, okay? Yes, for, Master. For balancing the, the scale of negative and positive. I'm very grateful, you know, I mean, uh, so many souls have been saved and the world has been saved. It's not the, the perfect world yet and not, but at least it's, at least it's still there. Hmm? Yes, Master, thank you very much. We're so grateful for, for that and, and for your, your work and EOSCAR to, to help uplift our planet. I'm grateful to all the EOSCAR phone cat. Yes, Master. Master, may we know how many more Tukwa may need to be matured for our planet to achieve world peace? Oh, take a lifetime, baby. My lifetime. I probably have to continue working until I die. Oh, Master. Then maybe. You see, human have to change. Not, yes, not just relying on heaven because... You know, like even if your parents are professor in the university and you are a student in high school even, you still have to do your homework. You still yes, have master. to learn in school and do your homework. You can't just rely on your professor parents. This is the thing. The parents can help you, yes, but you yourself <laughs> must grow up, must learn for your own. Yes, master. Your own wisdom, your own knowledge. Yeah, this is the thing. Human is a kind of slow to wake up because they have been, you know, kind of blindfolded and <sighs> cheated, truly cheated into an incorrect way of living. That's why. And they've been fed with so many things that is not good for their uh, intelligence as well as divine wisdom. Okay. Yes, Master. Understand. Thank you so much. Welcome. Master, um, may we know how many um, more Tukwa may be needed to mature to achieve world uh, vegan on our planet, Master? Well, I haven't counted yet. My God, it's not mathematically like that. I told you also. Yes, understand. First of all, it's difficult to predict human behavior because they have free will. Yes? And they influence... Yes, each other by their own behavior and by their own habits or background or by their sometimes uh, not correct um, concept about life and about what's right, what's wrong. And also sometimes they're also damaged, you know, by different 
different things that they've been taking since they were child. Yes, or their master. DNA. Or then also the negative power also keep whispering in their ears about many things that they shouldn't do, but they do it. You see what I mean? Because they are not strong enough spiritually, so they easily be swayed by all kinds of things, as social influence, Uh, family influence, you know, peers influence, and above all, negative influence. The astral people keep coming, going, and make trouble in our world. Oh. Yes. The hell people, near hell people sometimes, they have a break and then they just sneak up. Yes? Okay? Yes, Master. Oh, or, they have this, or they have this affinity to sneak up because some of their so-called friends in this world, you know, before they die, before they went to hell, there are friends in this world, they befriend some and then they came back and then they influence them. For example, like that, all the dead relatives come back and influence them. They don't have to come back long, they can be just a few minutes. You know, if they're allowed to come up, they can be influenced. A few minutes is enough for people to kill people. For war to oh. break out, yes, to break out, so for disaster to happen, all kind of things. This is a bad situation for all of us. Hmm? Okay. Yes, Master, of course. And humans also have free will and they also exercise it not always in the correct manner. Okay? Because they are influenced. Yes, Master. I told you, they're influenced. Or they're not well in their mind or in their heart. Yes, Master. Yeah. Due to drug, you know, yeah, eating wrong things, all kind of thing. Yeah, okay. Yes, yes. So, Master, we won't be able to know how long it would take you to um, achieve World Vegan on our planet through the upliftment of, of Tukwa and, and the development of, of our own uh, planet here, Master? I wish I, I can tell you. Yes, but, Master. But Thank that you. would be just like hocus pocus, you know? <laughs> Yes, I understand, Master. I tell you everything is the truth, okay? Yes, I, Master. I cannot just try to impress you or boast about things which is not true. So that is like that, okay? Like the parents, the professor parents can only help to a certain extent, but the child has to learn and improve, okay, for himself. Humans have to improve, have to know what's right, what's wrong, and act on the right thing. Okay? Mm. Yes, Master. I cannot keep eating for everybody else. Mm? Yes, I understand, Master. Mm. All right. I wish I could. You see, how many Master has come down? They tell all kinds of right things, but people sometimes twist it or use it for their own purpose because they're ambitious, or because they are power hungry, or because they also misunderstand. Hmm? Okay? Because they're not yes, enlightened master. enough to understand the word of the Master. Or is it too inconvenient for them to act out the word of yes, the master? master? Yes. They just do what they want or interpret it, the word of the past Master, to suit themselves. All right. Sorry. Sorry about that. So, at least you know what to do. At least you, your guys, you guys have been taught what's right, what's wrong, and you keep to it. And I'm glad about that. Okay, for you. Yes, Master, and we're very grateful for that, for the opportunity to learn and... and for you and your brother and sister, you know, there and out there, outside. Yeah. Okay, we do what we can. Yeah, okay? Yeah, right. Okay. Yes, Master. Thank you very much, Master. You're welcome, my love. Hi, Master. Hi. Last time you mentioned that you have to wait three or seven days or more in between entering higher OU or higher Tukwa. Mm -hmm. What do you do during this waiting period? Do you eat or do you just rest? I just sleep all day, all night. How about that? <laughs> <laughs> you wish, huh? No, no. I do other things. I meditate also, you know, uh, dutifully as usual. It's just not in the powerful connection area. Yes, because the, the, the cells, the body cells need to recover, need to rest, needs to 
uh, incorporate and need to send it out also some to the world and to the universe. Understand? I need time. Yes. Yes, Master. At that time. But I do all the things. I do everything else. Okay. Yes, Master. Right. Master, we pray you are safe and healthy. Thank you. I try very hard. I see. Master, how are beings in t u k w a created? And how long does it take for them to grow up? Instead of being in a mother's womb, are they like a tiny dot of light that grows bigger and bigger? In some of the lower world, in the shadow universe, uh, people are grown with By the lotus or by you know any other mean, uh, even mechanical mean or you know <laughs> kind of machinery, but nothing in this world that we can understand about that. But in t u k w a it doesn't grow like that. Okay, it's like uh, in the beginning maybe it's a big, massive, huge, great, immense. Uh, mass of energy, brilliant energy, and then it kind of s p l a s h out, you know. And then each individual uh, part of this energy will stay dormant for a long, long time. Eight uh, hundred something. Uh, I wrote it here somewhere. Was a b o t t l e Long, long time, huh? Long, long time. Until it mature, mm, I have written somewhere here. Can you be patient? Yes, master. I th- I think I have written, but where is it? Oh man, is it not in August? Is it? it should be in September. <laughs> Time passed so quick. Time passed so quick. I don't remember. I just want to say the exact number. Otherwise, it's uh, I could say approximately. But it's better to tell you the exact number. I can't remember. Okay, <laughs> and so many things I have to to write it down before I forgot. Well, because I wrote something together with it, you know, not just that. So I want to yes, to read it to you. I just saw it, and now it's gone. I remember writing something together with it, so I have to read it. You have time, yeah. Yes, we do, Master. No choice, huh? <laughs> <laughs> Oof. Oh, woman, what are you doing? <sighs> I just saw it just now, <laughs> before, before you asked me this question. Because I wrote so many things here, you know, something has uh, not uh, for you, so so I lost it in the in the jungle of my writing. Mm-hmm. Cannot be. Hmm. Not much going on in September, so it must be then in August. Okay. I forgot what I have written with it, so I have to check it out. Okay, I can't believe it. It's all gone. 
I don't know where. I lost it. If I find it again, I will update you, okay, huh? Yes, Master. Sufficient to say it is a long, long time, you know, like 800,000 something zillions of zillions in order of, or billions in order for it to mature. Wow. But then you can uh, empower it to make it faster. You understand, okay? Yes, Master. Oh, next time I will, uh, I will probably have to, <laughs> uh, like, uh, tape something on it, yeah? So that is easy to find. Yes, Master. Okay, okay, yeah. Yeah, anything else? Um, Sorry. Master, what is the process of evolution for the beings in Tukwa? For example, do they evolve and become, and become goddesses? They are originally the seed of goddesses, yeah? And when it mature, that means they are, have enough power to be goddesses, just like any other uh, original universe. Yes, Master. Right? I see. The same like original universe, when they mature, they accumulate and they develop the power. They, they keep absorbing, you know, and developing until they become or you. And just like other glasses, okay? Same. Same like the OU that I told you. Yes, Master. But it's very difficult to tell all this in uh, our language, okay? Yes, Master, we understand. Yeah. Yes, baby, anything more? Oh, uh, that's it for me, Master. Okay. Thank you, Master. You're welcome.